We were students of Oklahoma Prefectural Kurashiki Aki Junior and Senior High School. Our topic is application of the latency phenomenon to protected gear. The latency phenomenon is a phenomenon in which a substance that normally shows the properties of a liquid shows the properties of a solid when an external force is applied to it. For example, a mixture of polyurethane starch and water in a specific ratio has this property. This phenomenon can be applied to shock absorbers and bulletproof vests. So we think we can also apply it as a part of protective gear. What might the benefit be? Our purpose is to find out under what conditions the latency phenomenon occurs. Figure 1 shows the equipment we used. We prepared a liquid mixture of polyurethane starch and water. Then we dropped the weight into the mixture. To confirm if the phenomenon occurred or not, we took videos using a high frame rate smartphone camera. We used a weight of 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50 grams. We dosed the weight from a height of 2, 5, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50 centimeters. Now, we will discuss the results. In figure 2, the vertical axis shows the kinetic energy of the weight at the point of impact. Figure 2 does not show a clear lower limit on kinetic energy. In figure 3, the vertical axis shows the momentum of the weight at the point of impact. Figure 3 shows a clear lower limit on momentum at around 0.04 kg meters per second. To conduct more precise experience, we constructed a weight made of magnets and sand. By using this weight, we can easily and precisely adjust the mass and the center of mass is located near the bottom. So this weight holds vertically. Figure 5 shows that the lower limit of momentum is almost constant with mass. The momentum is given by P equals M root to the H. Our experience suggests that the occurrence of dial latency may largely depend on the momentum. This is our reference. Our future task is to determine what other things are involved in the occurrence of the phenomenon. Thank you for listening.